So we finally have for you guys the biggest leaks for Chapter 3 Season 4, and we even have for you guys some information about a brand new map coming in Chapter 3 Season 5, and you're not going to want to miss this, so make sure you guys stay tuned and have that bell notification on for the next upcoming days. Uh, so first things up is a brand new glider coming soon from Uncharted, so check this out. So that looks pretty fantastic in case you guys do in fact cop this with a brand new game release, be sure to use Code of Mars inside the Epic Games Store. Alongside that, a beloved skin pack is now returning tonight. The Graveyard Drift Pack is set to return by tonight. So in case you guys wanted this OG pack, well, it's no longer OG, so enjoy. And again, use Code of Mars to support me in the Fortnite item shop. Coming, th coming directly from Hasbro Pulse, before you hop off the Battle Bus, Join the Hasbro PulseCon Fortnite Victory Royale series panel on September 30th as we explore epic content and product brought to you by Fortnite's team. Uh, and joined by some very special guests, which is likely YouTubers. Uh, stay up to date on Hasbro.com slash Hasbro PulseCon. So that's actually pretty interesting in case you guys collect toys revolving around Fortnite or pop vinyls. Well, there you guys have it. Uh, about Season 4, however, we have for you guys a brand new teaser that's taking place right now in Times Square in New York City. So that is actually very, very cool looking. I'm not quite sure why they're pushing this cereal so hard, but it obviously has something to do with the Fortnite storyline and, well, Season 4 in general. Now, this is the biggest leak of today's video, and so far the biggest leak for Season 4 and Season 5. Here we have some spark notes. According to upcoming content, Season 4's theme will officially be Dark Futuristic. Season 5 will also have a massive update, and it's not Creative Mode 2.0, which could be like a massive map change or something. Now apparently for Season 5, it actually will be some sort of brand new map according to several leakers. So yeah, that is actually pretty crazy. Uh, not entirely sure how I feel about that. I don't really know if Chapter 3 will end at Season 5, but I do believe that we're going to be seeing a qu quite the actual map change for some reason. Whether that's because Season 4 will feature a live event which we already know about, or whether it's actually for Credible 2.0, we still have no idea. But needless to say, there's a lot of crazy content coming in Season 4's dark futuristic theme, and alongside that, Season 5's brand new huge, huge, overall 100% map change. Now, what's pretty funny is yesterday that kind of coincides with the brand new Chrome theme that people think that's going to be. Uh, it looks like it was trending over on Twitter and it says Chrome. Fortnite appears to be teasing a collaboration with Google Chrome uh, following a series of tweets in which the capital letters within each phrase spell out the name of the web browser. Which is incredibly funny because obviously the person who runs Twitter and this like viral section does not even remotely know anything about Fortnite or what's going on right now. They legit think that it's Fortnite x Google Chrome, which is absolutely hilarious, but that is definitely not the case if you're watching today's video. However, we have for you guys some more crazy stuff coming in Season 4, so it says Fortnite Chapter 3 Season 4 competitive details by the Fortnite team. Competitors, it's almost time for a new Fortnite season, and with a new season comes a new competitive update. In Chapter 3, Season 4, the competitive Fortnite team is shaking things up with a brand new Fortnite Division Cup format, an arena hype reset at the beginning of the Fortnite season, late game cups, zero build cups, uh, cola gate cups, and more. Continue reading on for full details of what competitive Fortnite has in store for Chapter 3, Season 4. Now, this promo image for Season 4 definitely teases some upcoming things returning from the vault in Chapter 3, Season 4. The rocket launcher has been seen in a recent blog post, and it uses an updated version of the guided missiles projectile, which might be a teaser for the items returning after 4 years. In the matter of two days, Cyber PK's outfit should be announced. Four Battle Pass teasers will be announced. 
Chrome trending on Twitter, ATKs, and he got a missile possibly returning with a brand new blog post. Plus, the constant marketing team Fortnite has been doing about Fortnite Paradise. This is a season that's going to be remembered, I hope, for a long time. Which I completely agree. They've been spending a crap ton of money on this, and likely when they do this, it usually means that it's going to be a great season. Spending this much money is usually not normal. So it should be a bit, it should be a great season full of great stuff, returning stuff from the vault, and possibly a huge love event that will potentially change the game forever during season five or the end of season four. So definitely stay tuned for that. Uh, last but not least, we have for you guys a little bonus. It's a brand new Fortnite Tech Talk that honestly, I think we all feel like this. It was at this moment he knew he was eliminated. Uh, so yeah, guys, that's all I have for you guys for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy the Battlefield gameplay, and we will see you guys in tomorrow's brand new teasers. The year is 1991. Birds and people are living together in seemingly perfect harmony. Until one day, a young man catches fire. This is Phoenix. Phoenix.